In this video, I'm going to show you how I set up a Delta Neutral strategy to take advantage of future funding rates for fun and profit. I'm going to short sell a futures contract for a crypto asset to gain the funding rates, and I'm going to buy the underlying asset on spot markets to hedge my position. Let's first look at how futures contracts work. Derivatives make up the majority of volume traded on cryptocurrency markets, and perpetual futures is the most popular of these. You can see here the Bitcoin US dollar tether perpetual futures contract on Binance. And a trader can use this to buy long if he thinks the price is going to go up or sell short if he thinks the price is going to go down. Now, the way these contracts track the price of the underlying asset is for a funding fee. And what this does is if there's more longs than shorts, then the longs will pay the shorts a funding rate to hold that position. This incentivizes people to take a short position balancing the contract. The funding rate on some futures contracts has got to astronomical levels. You can see here the Reef US Dollar Tether Perpetual Futures contract has a funding rate of 0.4% every eight hours. That's 1.2% a day. That's absolutely massive. And it's simply because we're in a bull market and everyone is expecting this asset to go up in value. But we can take advantage of this by short selling the futures contract and then buying the underlying asset on spot markets. For example, with the Bitcoin US Dollar Tether market we looked at earlier, we could short sell the Bitcoin US dollar Tether futures contract, gain the funding rate fee, and then buy the equivalent amount of Bitcoin on spot markets to hedge our position. If Bitcoin moves up and down, it doesn't matter because one position will hedge the other and we'll be collecting that funding rate fee. So let's look at how this works in practice. First, we're going to go into our futures account. This is in derivatives US dollar M futures on Binance. And I'm going to transfer some money in. So I've got 100 US dollars in my spot account. I'm going to transfer half of that into my futures account. So if we open up the spot market on the left here for Reef US dollar Tether, and then the petrol futures contract on the right, what we're going to do is purchase as much Reef as possible on the spot market. I'm not using leverage here. So we've got 1286. And then quickly, before the price changes, I'm going to short sell the same amount of reef on the futures contract. And we've got positions both on the spot market and the futures market, which should hedge each other out over time. And as you can see, the next funding rate is in four hours, and we're going to be getting 0.4% just for holding that position. And that's a pretty exceptional return for a delta neutral strategy. If reef goes up in price, then our spot account makes money and our futures account loses money, but overall we're still making money because of the funding rate. If it goes down in price, then the opposite is true, and the futures account makes money and the spot account loses money. And there might be some rebalancing involved there if that gets too out of hand. There is an opportunity cost as well for doing this. You're essentially putting your funds into US dollar. And the reason that these funding rates are so high at the moment is because we're in a bull market and traders are expecting the price to carry on going up. By allocating our funds to this type of strategy, we miss on out on them potential returns. But it's a great way if you want to take some profits out of the markets, then to put those funds to work and get them producing a really great return for not doing a whole lot of work. And this whole strategy can be automated and made more efficient. I've talked about that more on my blog. Now, 1% a day doesn't sound particularly exciting, but even if we allow for half our funds to be used for hedging, then this compounded daily provides a 1,800% return APY. That means if we invested $1,000 in this strategy, we'd end up with $18,000 at the end of the year. Now, is this sustainable? No, not a chance. As soon as the price drops, it'll take out all the longs and the funding rates will be reset. But it's a really good example of just how much opportunity there is in cryptocurrency markets right now. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you're interested in learning more about generating passive income from DeFi and cryptocurrency markets, then subscribe to the channel and hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Thank you for watching.